yeah, yeah, I said troops in the slug. So it's on from a dare, mind so strong I can make them pause in the air. I flat screen any corn without a care. HD stand for you hating dog and it's clear. Rap fam, I got mad grams. Dot every corner they eating, come get a pack, man. Half a gallon out the bottle on that man. I see through y'all pussies, don't get your cat scanned. Nah, I'm not on it. My block warring, acting sick with your click and get a shot for it. I need a bitch if she thick till I hop on it. I ain't playing with them buns, I'm trying to hot dog it. Catch up to my pimp and I got 80 hoes. You keep a sour crowd, must have been hating though. No. But they ain't getting Nathan's. I don't really care. Them Bike boys throw it up, a big willy here. Yeah, I said double the grinding. You could stay out of it, the trouble will find them. Couple of rings with a couple of diamonds shining. Blew it in the eyes on a blind man. Shit, I say real niggas feel, yeah. If you don't like me, it's cool, I'm still here. But when the whole crowd ruling and you feel weird, my niggas will push him around, he will chill. Right, I'm like, fuck you. It's a road game from Milwaukee. Send them bucks through. Wow. Whoever wanna book me, what up to you? Just make sure my money there and my cup full. Nah. Good. People don't really understand how big this battle thing is. Yeah. Shout out to Smack, right? Smack, I was, you know, we always speak, that's my homie. He said, yo, Jay, get there at least by 5.30. Nah. I walked in like 6.30, I swear. The whole Webster Hall, you couldn't move. It was flooded. It was flooded. Mm -hmm. Now, they treat this like this is a whole new underground thing. I don't know why no sponsors yet have yet spent a check on these. Because this art of rapping is crazy. Mm -hmm. Now, Goods is like one of the top battles, you know, slash rappers in the URL game. How did you start doing it? I got and I started URL or just yeah. period? Just period, really. Just, um, I was going home one day from school. I was about up maybe like, I don't know, like nine. And it was a group of people in a cypher just rapping. They was battling and I didn't know what was going on. So I stopped and I was listening for a minute. And I probably did for like an hour, and then even know two hours. And I got my ass whooped that day. And then, I don't know, from then on I just was doing it. Oh, yeah. Did you just attack the battle scene or did you take it home and start writing something? Nah, I just started writing, period. Like, I, I probably was like eight. I'm gonna say like eight. I just started writing, period. Like, see, people don't know, like, I wasn't really, I was just somebody that, that could do the battle shit. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I, I was in all the ciphers, wherever they was before, you know, the cameras was out. I was in every cipher and stuff like that. I was doing music and doing both. So I always try to, like, do both. Even back then, I was doing both. You know what I'm saying? So just in case, I, I always wrote raps like, I'd rather a nigga try to get him in a cypher, I'm gonna spit these at him, like that. <laughs> so that, 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 that's just what it was. So I always made sure I did both the music and you know I had raps on the side just for the cyphers and the, the battles and all that. You're one of the top battlers in, in, in the country. People know you, you know, you get a million views. Now, is, it any, is there any way that, you know, like a lot of, when you get to the peak and you get to the top of your career, a lot of them just stop battling? Will you stop battling? I, I'm never going to say I'm going to stop because it might be a dude that just grabbed my attention where I want to battle. He might be the top nigga at the time and I feel like I got to take him out. So I'm never going to say I'm going to stop. You know what I'm saying? I can't say that. Okay. I, I don't feel like I'm going to stop. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but. And that money be kind of decent, so. You know? You know? You know? Money be I mean, but see, people, <laughs> see, 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 people don't know. Every uh, everybody get paid different, so I can't talk for nobody else. The money for me be be, be good. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So I mean, you might you might get one of those battle rappers in here, and you know they ain't getting paid as much as me, and you know they might stop. Who do you feel was your strongest opponent? Toughest opponent. Mm -hmm. Toughest. Um. That's a question I got. So, uh, I don't know. I always got a different answer for that, yo. I don't know why. It's just like <laughs> I feel like everybody I faced was was tough in their own way. But um, maybe Hollow the Dawn. That was, that was my last battle, and you know what I'm saying. Hollow Dawn's a top tier. It's like, and it's not even because of him. It's just because certain people got like a crazy big following. Yeah. So 
Nowadays, though, the battle is not based on if you beat somebody. It's a, it's a popularity contest. It's like it's like whoever the fans like more, which is which is what now. That's why, honestly, the battle shit to me is like kind of watered down. Mm -hmm. I'm from the everywhere. You know, you see a nigga you battle him on the street just because his man was talking shit to your man. Yeah. So like right now it's real watered down. I was at the last event, smacked at the time, and it's counting people down. It's looking like a boxing match. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it, it, it's real, it ain't it ain't what it just got a low low Hollywood. You know what I'm saying? I'm not used to they they got mics and it's a whole bunch of you know. I'm used to standing in the middle of the crowd and rapping. Well, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know. But what the I'm money saying? got a little bit better though. The that's, money that's, definitely. That's got why I got glamming. Like, yeah. Cause the cow it's WWF straight. now. But how do you feel about the personal blows? Like you know, it's one thing to just keep it real generic and. Huh? No, but it, I mean, but I mean, Come see, I mean, to some people, that's just what it is. I mean. I don't, I don't really got a, um, like a, I can curse, right? Yeah. yeah. I don't really got a fucked up background to the point where I'm going to be worried about what somebody going to say, like, good got knocked out before, or good, you know, like, I don't, I don't really got a bad background, so I don't really care going into the battles with somebody say, because my background or my rap sheet is not bad, so I don't really worry about that, so uh, my only rule, because yeah. I, I always got a rule when I go in, don't say nothing about my daughter, don't okay. say okay. My daughter not gonna grow up watching you say something about me on a DVD. It's just not gonna happen. Now, you know, you can say something about my mother. You can do it. It's bad on so I'm not gonna cut everything out. You know, so this is my daughter. My daughter's only four years old. We're not gonna talk about her. That's true. Yeah. So that was it. I've never seen a person have like he has like a full. He has a henny bottle while he's rapping. <laughs> yeah, but that's what I I think I think in my next battle they ain't gonna let me bring a henny bottle. Oh, word. Yeah, I can't really say why, but they're not gonna let me bring it anymore. Down. Huh? Is it going to affect your style or your craft anymore? No, because I'll pour some in the cup. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think subconsciously I'm a shy dude, and I think maybe the oh, Henny, I think maybe the Henny, you know, loosens me up. I don't know. Because you go crazy. Like, it's like, I do. like, it's something like, you know, Maybe Henny's watching and somebody's watching. Maybe you just need to deal with that. Nah, nah, no, we, we, we got that in the making right now. Okay. okay. I didn't want to talk about that. We got that in the making, though. But, um, like, I really don't know. Like, like you know, like, like a, a battle rapper, it, it's, certain, it's certain kind of battle rappers that separate themselves from other battle rappers when you create your own lane. You know what I'm saying? The people like um, Mook. Sirius Jones, you know, like niggas like Lux, like they made their own lane to the point where it, it like somebody would be like, he sound like Moop or he sound like Lux. Yeah. And I came in and I created my own lane. Now you got people saying he sound like Goods. Yeah. So that like that alone is like big for me and that and that and that's all I really worry about. So, you know who, so who's the person that, that a lot of people are comparing comparing you? I mean, the person they saying that sounds like Goods now. Um, you trying to put people on the <laughs> well, I don't know, I mean, I mean, whoever, yeah, whoever, like, like, who, whoever's in the, um, you know, smack out the drink called the Proving Ground, you know what I'm saying, it's just, it's just like people coming up, they'll they be like, oh, he sound like good, if anybody holds a cup and a liquor in their hand and rap, they're trying to be me, basically, you know what I'm saying, because I'm the first dude that did that on camera. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So if you see any dude that hold, and I'm not trying to say he biting me or whatever, but if he's holding a couple liquor rapping, then he automatically got that from me because you never saw. I mean, I'm gonna just be, I'm gonna just be straight real. Yeah. Everybody that slow down, they flow. Just watch people from when they rap five years ago to yeah. when they rap now. Everybody flow slow down. I'm not saying they got it from me, but I mean, hey, I'm the first dude that came in with a slow flow drinking a cup of Henny. And, 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 I mean, everybody had that run-on flow, and they da -da 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 -da, and I came in with a slow flow. Now, if you watch people, people that slow, they flow down, they pause, and after they punch lines, hey, I'm not saying they got that from me, but hey. <laughs> <laughs> when's your next battle? Or uh, are you are you gonna battle somebody? Um, I just I just um I just did a blog and I called out Hitman Holler. Okay. All right, and um I, I believe in big battles. You know what I'm saying? So. I try to take the big battles. Yeah. That, that's gonna be a big battle. Like, I, if, if it's not gonna be a big battle, I, I don't really want to do it. I actually got the half a gallon album dropping in September. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, yeah, and mad people. I didn't know how much people is actually willing to buy my album. 
Till I start putting it out and saying it, saying it, then my Facebook going crazy. I got people like, you supposed to drop it? I was supposed to drop it around the hollow battle, and I didn't. Yeah. And they killing me for it. So I see, all right, people was inter interested in me doing music. I don't do the battle stuff to battle. I do it to um, an outlet for my music. Yeah. To show people I can actually do the music. That's what I actually do. That's the reason I had these situations. And niggas don't know that. I was fucking with Swiss and had this situation with Warner Brothers. It wasn't because I could battle. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I do it for. But I called out Hitman Holland because I feel like that would be a big battle. And you know what I'm saying? He, like, like niggas don't understand, when you get to a certain level, when you a top dude, the, the people you could battle get smaller. Because I'm not going to lie to you, I don't believe in giving nobody a chance. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I ain't going to lie to you. I don't believe in giving, mm -hmm. um, like, I, like Young L called me out. I don't believe in giving niggas chances. You know what I'm saying? Because I got more to lose than they do. Yeah. As me being one of the top tier battles, I got way more to lose. If they spit three decent rounds, yeah. it's going to sound so much better because it's going against me. So I don't believe in getting nobody chance. I just got too much to lose. And that's just real. I don't know. The fans don't like it. Hey, I don't, I don't believe in getting nobody chance. I'd rather take another one. That's 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 like that. Yeah, but they don't, the fans don't care about business. They just want to see you battle. Yeah. They, never, they, they don't think like that, but I do. You know what I'm saying? So. I called out Hitman Holly, he another top tier dude. I don't know, he acting a little shaky. I, I don't know. Scared? I, I guess. Who's your top five battle rappers? You know what's crazy? Because after the other night, a lot of shit changed, man. What's that? Because a lot of niggas got body. Yeah. A lot of people lost their career on that stage. Wow. Yeah, and it's like. Wow. Right now, my top, my top five is. Not can not saying myself, right? Yeah, not saying yourself. Nah, I wasn't gonna say myself anyway. <laughs> oh, um, my top five. Active, non active. Active, non active. Relevant. Like yo, I'm great come back, man. I wanna battle you. Cause you said you only ever battle the big dog, so say your top five and then, you know, the dream battle. The uh, money battle. Alright, top I, my top five active right now that's relevant is Charlie Clips. Shout out to Charlie. Um, yeah, that's my bro. Shout out to Charlie Clips. Um, Hitman Holla. Holla the Dawn. Holla the Dawn. Rex. T Rex. And Austin. Okay. What about DNA? I think I think DNA is right there. Like DNA is a problem. Like that that's what I said. It's like it's a DNA nigga I won't give a shot to. You know, you know what I'm saying? It's like because he it's a possibility he might win. You understand what I'm saying? So I think like like I I think like you got heavyweight, you got them top tier dudes, and then you got the dudes that's right under them, and then you got the dudes under them. So DNA is like one of the dudes that's right under the the heavyweights. He's like a welter. I mean, I like he's like a light heavyweight. He's like right under there. That's you know just my opinion. Okay, so. Who's the who's the three wackiest dudes that she's like, man, I can't believe <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why he got he got he had a yo, good shot and then you know Yo, real talk, man, and I'm and this this is me being real and I said this on on another interview. I don't think nobody in URL is whack. I think at any given time you can lose to anybody in URL. I think that's what separates URL from other stages like grind time and stuff like that because it's a little it is it is like it's like 15 rappers or something like that, or 20 rappers, yeah. and all of them is nice. I said, you know, like, Grind Time will have uh, like 150 rappers, <laughs> and fucking 149 of you whack. Wow. wow. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, they, you know what I'm saying? I just exaggerate a little bit more, you know. But nah, you give, you most give of them will be, yeah, mo most of them will be whack. I think in, um, in, in URL is like everybody. It's nice. Everybody in your row is nice. You can lose to anybody in your row at any given time. Look at Cal like Calico coming up. You know what I'm yeah. saying? The boy Calico, crazy. He coming up. Um, Surf, crazy. K Shine, crazy. It's like anybody you DNA, crazy. Anybody you name is nice. You can't say they're not nice. It's not even like they are right. All, yeah. all of them is nice. You will lose to anybody at any given time. That's why I, you know I pick my battle smart. It got to be worth it. If I'm going to lose, it has to be worth it.